one for all. Full calling! Time to start the game. This is just a warning shot. Those wannabe heroes are gonna be pulled off their pedestals. My Hero Academy, season three. All right, so this is the third season review of My Hero Academy, and I love this show. I mean, look at this t-shirt. I mean, I only buy shirts of shows I like, and I have to say, I love this show. So basically, the third season of My Hero Academy is set into multiple story arcs this season. The first part of the story is they're at camp, and basically the villains attack and steal Bakuto, and then, the most awesome episodes, uh, I mean, I was tearing up at some moments, was when we see All Might and All For One, or One For All, or whatever the guy's name is, fight, and it's so incredible, brutal, and you realize that this is the end for All Might, he'll never be this powerful again, he's lost the full spark, and another thing of this uh, season, we're seeing Deku, he's trying to become his own hero, he's not trying to fall in the direct footsteps of All Might. And the last part of the show, it was really cool seeing the, the seeing the, the, in the uh, preliminary exams or the preliminary hero so they can become junior heroes, basically. Overall, this was a hell of a season. I very much enjoyed My Hero Academy Season 3. I thought this was a, I mean, I talked about it a lot on the TV Recap Show, so if you want to hear me talk more about it, talk, listen to that. But I really enjoyed what they did this far this season. I'm looking forward to season four and the big three. Holy shit, they are cool. So, guys, have you seen My Hero Academy season three? More thoughts, comment below. Let me know. And guys, if you'd like to deal with that thumbs up button, subscribe to see more. Tell your friends about Easy Nation. All too easy. <laughs>